Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe our channel for more videos. McCain just issues sick anti-American order to commissioned officers about what they must to do Trump now. America's most infamous traitor, John McCain, has been obsessed to take out Trump from the day our new president was sworn into office. We learned recently that McCain was behind the fake Russian dossier against Trump, and has been feeding leaks to the liberal media, where the icing on the cake came several weeks ago when McCain officially killed the Obamacare repeal, becoming the left's instant hero. But amazingly, the two-time failed presidential candidate still isn't done putting the screws to America. The brain-rotting crustacean gave the commencement speech for the U.S. Naval Academy this week, where he decided to throw not only our president under the bus, but our entire country as well. And the order McCain gave to these newly commissioned officers will leave you in complete disbelief. It doesn't come as much of a surprise that given the golden opportunity to publicly bash Trump, that McCain would jump at the chance. What is surprising however, is that John McCain, who fancies himself as a war hero, would tell these newly commissioned officers to not put America first. McCain began his speech by predictably taking a swipe at Trump and his entire administration. But later in the speech is when McCain proved to the world just how many brain cells he's apparently lost with his recent brain cancer diagnosis, where he made the asinine demand that these newly commissioned officers should not put America first, and should try to blend with other countries such as Europe. McCain said that as a statesman, that he had concluded that the American example and American leadership are indispensable to securing a peaceful and prosperous future, and that there could be no more isolationism, no more tired resignation no more America first. Putting America first is the very reason that young men and women decide to sign up for the military in the first place, but apparently the message of patriotism and love for country are attributives that John McCain has lost along the way as he's stepped on literally everyone in his path over the years to ensure that his own selfish personal political agendas were fulfilled. 